Hi, I'm Dustin. And I'm Dylan. From the DCSSW. This is the Country Scroller channel on YouTube where we'll be doing scrolling videos and some other random videos. We hope you enjoy. Okay, in today's video we're going to be making this welcome sign. Next, I have my piece of wood that it'll fit on. I'm going to pay attention to the grain. It's running vertical, so I want that to be on there like that. First, we're going to put this masking tape over it, going up and down. Again, this is a procedure just to help with peeling up the pattern in the end. And believe me, if uh, you don't use this, peeling up the pattern from just the spray adhesive can be a pain. So I got the masking tape on there now. Next is to apply the pattern to it. Got the pattern on my tray. I flipped it upside down. Now I'm going to just spray on the spray adhesive. Now I'm going to put it on to the wood. Okay, next with the tape. Now we got the clear box tape over it. Now over to the drill press to make the entry holes. Okay, now I'm going to try to do this one handed so I can at least show you drilling it. I've only got four entry holes to do one in this O, the other two are in the gun, and then one in the big middle. So here we go. didn't quite work out with holding the camera in that same time so I'm going to go ahead and do the entry holes and I'll be back with you at the work table. Got the entry holes done, now over to the scroll saw to cut it out. Over at the scroll saw now, we're going to begin our cuts. I like to do the smaller cuts first before I do this big one. That just uh, helps so I don't tear anything up when I'm maneuvering a piece of wood on the scroll saw. Here we go. Cut on the inside now. the interior cuts all done now to do the outside I'm gonna start down here at the uh, bottom of this E to get entry spot
cuts are done and uh, over to the work table. Now to peel up the pattern, start at a spot and uh, just peel it up. If you're lucky like that, sometimes you get the whole thing to peel up at one time. It's pretty cool. So there's our product. We're going to do a little bit of sanding on it and then uh, just a clear coat finish and it's done. I'm using this Craftsman quarter sheet sander. Uh, I don't have any other sanding things like the sand flea or anything like that to do this. So it works good enough for me. side okay now we're gonna burn in the back Now that we got the burned in the back done, I'm just going to explain why I don't use a wood burning kit or tool. One reason is I don't have one. Another reason is, well they're sort of cheap at Walmart, 10 bucks, but it's a unique way just using a propane torch and a nail and uh, just drawing it in there. So now I'm going to give her a clear coat and we're done. We're going to use this Krylon clear spray cook again. We're going to do the same thing to the other side. I'm not going to tape that, but um, you get the gist. And there's our final product. It's a nice, easy, fast little welcome sign. And it'll go good anywhere on top of a door or wherever you want to put it. So uh, subscribe or whatever you want to do. Watch this video. We appreciate it. Thanks for watching.